Hey, what is going on guys? Expert Fusion here and today I wanted to talk about brand new leaks regarding Call of Duty Black Ops 5 or Black Ops 2020, whatever the hell you want to call it. I personally think it's going to be called Black Ops 2020 or just called Black Ops, just like Modern Warfare is just being called Modern Warfare. I don't think they're going to go with the 5 at the end of the, the title. Um, but this leak coming from, you know, the Gaming Revolution, coming from Matthew Harris at Gaming Intel, it's coming from a few different people, and they both had different things to say about it, and honestly, there's parts of it I believe, parts of it I don't believe, parts of it I think very can be 100% true, and other parts are obvious, other parts are like, that's definitely not happening. It's kind of all over the place, but there are a few interesting things in here, some of which I believe will happen, and I'm really hyped about. Um, there's also some stuff that's in here that I'm not really hyped about and I'm kind of upset about. I'm not going to go over everything within the leak. I'll link the article down in the you know description, but I want to talk about Blackout and the fact that according to these leaks, Blackout will be coming to this Black Ops reboot. So they say that Raven will be focusing on bringing Blackout into the updated engine, though once again Treyarch has complete oversight. Treyarch has apparently happy was apparently happy with their first crack at the battle royale genre but feels there is much more potential to be found according to the game and revolution sources they want to focus on the adult market when it comes to black ops black ops 5s or whatever it's called ren edition of blackout gaming intel's own sources match up with most of what gaming revolution sources has said though with any leaks it is always important to take them with a hefty pinch of salt um, it's still a long way off, so some of these leaks could be inaccurate, is basically what they're trying to say. That sounds awesome to me. That is great, because I love Blackout. I think it's easily the best part of Black Ops 4. I think it's some of the most fun I've had in Call of Duty for the past few years. It's such a well-done game mode, in my opinion. Graphics already look pretty nice for the game, you know? They're not the best in the world, but they're not the worst either. But bringing this mode to a new engine with, you know, the new guns in the new game, with the new equipment in the new game, or maybe bringing back some old equipment, whatever, would be amazing. Now, I assume they would use the same map, which I'd be completely fine with, but imagine that. They bring over this map, they bring over Alcatraz, they bring over maybe another third map that they come out with, maybe they update this map a little bit more. They can do so much, and I want them to do that because I don't want them to just get rid of Blackout, you know? Originally, I could tell that Blackout was supposed to be something they were going to continuously update for a couple of years now, but obviously, since now their development on their next game has been moved up a year, they need to kind of forget about Black Ops 4 to a degree. I mean, obviously, after the season's done, uh, then they'll forget about it, and they need to start working on their next game, or at least continue working on their next game because they've already started. And I think Blackout going over to that game would be massive. Now, it would be a part of the game, but based on these leaks and also based on just common sense and what is a definitely a possibility is the fact that it would be free to play. I mean, that would be a smart move from Activision to bring Blackout, Blackout to the brand new engine with a new map, with new guns, with all sorts of new stuff. Have it be a part of Black Ops, the reboot of Black Ops, or maybe make it a separate thing even. That would be completely fine. And maybe you can add a Mono Warfare style map too and have it free to play with its own microtransaction system that allows people to, you know, tier up and rank up the game. Imagine that, you can you can tier up and unlock stuff in Blackout from Black Ops as well as from Modern Warfare, that would be really cool. And you can unlock skins in the multiplayer of those two separate games and then those skins you can maybe use in Blackout. They can do all sorts of things with this brand new engine, with these brand new um, studios working, or these not brand new studios, but you know, the studios working together now in different locations than they would have previously. I'm, I think it has potential. So, to me, I'm excited for the future, I am. I People aren't, they're saying they have no hope. They just said Modern Warfare is probably gonna be a good game, but that's about it. They think Black Ops 2020 is, is dead, it's gonna die out, it's gonna be shit. But you have to realize, Black Ops 4 did not have much development time. They had a lot of problems behind the scenes, and honestly, a lot of the problems, I blame Activision wholeheartedly. Activision just needs to, there's a few things Activision needs to do. First of all, they need to step their asses, they need to take their heads 
out of the asses of the developers. Let the developers create the game they want to make. Whether or not you believe it's going to be bad for the direction of the company, let the developers do it. They know what they're doing, especially Treyarch. They do know what they're doing. People hate on Treyarch all they want, but they know what they're doing. They do. They've made some fantastic games. Black Ops 1, Black Ops 2, Black Ops 3, to my opinion, is a fantastic game. Black Ops 4, they were able to take something that was clearly in shambles and turn it into a decent, well-rounded game that is still enjoyable for a lot of people, still enjoyable for me personally. Of course, there's a whole hate mob on the game right now, but that's besides the point. You know, the hate mob is there because it's the newest Call of Duty. It's the bandwagon. It's the popular thing to hate on this game. So people jump on it and do the same thing. But personally, the fact that they're trying to make this maybe an adult-marketed battle royale rather than like a kid-marketed one like Fortnite is already in its own right exciting as hell. The fact that it'll be on the brand new engine is already exciting as hell. So in my opinion, I think we have a bright future. Of course, there were some other leaks about this game, about the campaign, about zombies, something about the zombies ether story being rebooted, which I just, I don't, I don't, I don't know why they would do that. Just whatever. It is what it is. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know what you think about Blackout returning in Call of Duty Black Ops 2020 or Call of Duty Black Ops 5, whatever the hell it's called. I'll see you guys in my next one. Peace out.